It's Ronnie Boy time. <laughs> yeah, still here. Uh, been a little busy. Uh, we'll get into that later. Uh, got a good hired man, though. Emil. He, he, he says to me, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, he's being this hired man ain't so bad. You know, all these young guys in, uh, they don't like being a hired man. He, he says, I think it's a pretty good deal. <laughs> of course he does. <laughs> well, he did say, though, he says, uh, I get uh, a little spe more special treatment, <laughs> though, I guess, he says. <laughs> yeah, he does. Uh, I kind of think I could, like, uh, he's not my hired man. We farm together. Yeah. Uh, but he had a good way of thinking about it. He says it's a good thing that I didn't buy his farm, that I rent it. Say, for instance, if one of us should lose our farm, you know, financially or otherwise, he says, then we we still got one we can play on. <laughs> yeah, that's a good thought. You know, it, it, then, you know, financially, yeah, that's, that's a good thought. Something happens, I go belly up, bankrupt or something like that. They can't touch his. He owns it. <laughs> uh, speaking of going bankrupt, <laughs> uh, did some remodeling. Barn, uh, I figure uh, no need to be milking on two farms. I just did some remodeling, and uh, I'll just be milking on the one farm. And... Uh, Use other one for machinery, crops, uh, other cattle, and stuff like that. So, uh, needed a bigger milk house. Um, changing around, poured, ripped up some concrete, poured some others, and stuff like that. It's just uh, more convenient for milking a few more cows, and this way I only have to milk on one from. And uh, works good that way. Pretty nice, though. I have an email for my hired man. The uh, hired man. Uh, wake up in the morning and get to the barn. He's got the milk house utensils all rinsed and the pipeline rinsed and everything, everything, everything ready to go. And he takes care of the milk house chores after I'm done milking, and I go right to. Well, pretty soon it'll be field work. Of course, he'll be helping in field work too, and so like that. He says we we farm together. <laughs> okay, uh, that's about it. Let us know I'm still here. Been asked to make a couple semi runs for this fellow. You know, he says I just don't have time anymore. <laughs> I don't. Um. Uh, and instead, uh, something else new. I don't rent animals, cows, or cattle from him anymore. I bought them. I bought his herd. It's better that way if something happens to him and stuff like that. You know, I'm the one taking care of him anyway, so I'll buy him. So that, that's it. Uh, going to be a lot more um, fresh air smell around here. Fresh farm country smell around here with that many more cattle running around here <laughs> but uh, that's the nature of it all right just let you know what's what here and uh, doctor don't like that I'm doing taking on this big step here but he says on the other hand it's probably what's keeping you going yet well better thank you for watching the Ronnie oh where's it my golden cow pie. See that? Amo gave me that. He says, that's your golden cow pie. <laughs> so, <laughs> okay. Thank you for watching the Roddy Boy Show.